Lourdes, I wanted to strengthen my faith. And being in Lourdes did that, and it also made me build great friendships with people that I never thought I would. And then when I came back, everyone was like, oh, I wish I'd done it, but I just couldn't do it because of the bus journey. So I think people realised it from my photos and all that, that it was a good experience. Because I thought it would be a good religious experience with my friends. Because um, I thought it, was, it would have been a once in a lifetime opportunity and I just wanted to go and have uh, pals in that. It was a fantastic journey. Um, it was really good, it showed your teamwork skills. Oh, the bus journey, I really enjoyed it. It was my birthday on the bus, so uh, all my friends got balloons and party hats and stuff and I enjoyed it. It was really overwhelming. It was more than I expected it to be. I always remember when we were just getting up to the hotel and it was four o'clock in the morning and I remember seeing the sanctuary and I kind of had a wee bit of excitement come over me because I didn't expect it to be like it was. I thought the grotto was good because I just didn't expect it to be like the big massive chapel and it's three tiers and it was just a massive big place. Just we got to see like how many people there was, like with the same faith as you and like how much it meant to everyone. Yeah, when I got there, um, just kind of seeing everyone and seeing how everybody had a great faith and wanted to like pray and I was just like, oh, this is great. Stations of the Cross. I think Station of the Cross, like usually seen in church and posters all around the place. But this was a walk and a half to get to the top and then walk down. At each station, a member of our group read from the prayer book and we had our school chaplain, Father Thomas, say we pray and discuss each station of the cross in detail. We got to understand that station of the cross in more depth and detail. I would say the candlelit procession on the Saturday night, because it was a wee bit cooler, because it was really warm as well, and just seeing like everyone who had like different languages singing and praying, it was just a really overwhelming experience. Like it was so together, like it didn't matter what language it was in. Everyone kind of understood what was going on and everybody felt the same thing. It was quite like emotional to see because like you don't understand how many sick people are actually in Lourdes and like how sick they really are. And it's good that they're getting the opportunity to see like Lourdes as well. It was a fantastic experience where you get to meet new friends and strengthen relationships with others and it was a fantastic experience I would definitely recommend. I would really, really recommend it because it was I will never forget like my experience and it was amazing. Definitely go, like you you've really got another chance to go and like you'll take a lot back for it. Take the opportunity because like, it's like a once in a lifetime opportunity and not many people can say they've been to Lourdes and like, it's great to see. People who don't have a great faith or have no faith at all and if they go then they can turn to this and maybe if have a faith or in a time of like, struggle they can turn to it. The fact that I went with probably two pals and came back with 21 hours if that makes sense. There was a small group of us, but we all managed to bond, and these people might make friends who they'll never forget. So I would recommend someone to go to Lourdes.